welcome to our studio. This is actually the entrance to our store. And what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to take you through our gallery and then into our back room where we actually manufacture our jewelry. Come on in. You can see that we have a big range of jewelry here that we design and create right in the back, which I'll be showing you in a minute. All kinds of things made of starting with sheet metal, working in a traditional technique that is indigenous to the American Southwest. And back here we have a selection of wedding rings. And in our store we just have a few of the things that we do. We actually have a much more extensive selection on our website. Okay, now we're going to leave our gallery and go into our back room, our workshop, and shipping area. Oh, Helen, oh. say hi. Hi. <laughs> this is Helen, my wife. We started this company in 1995. I started taking uh, 20 of Helen's designs and I took them on the road and was selling all over the country and that's how we started. Amazingly enough. It took a little while though. It took a little while. It wasn't easy. <laughs> Alright, Helen's going to the gallery. We're going to come in through here. This is our shipping area. Come on in through. Barbara does coordination production. All the orders come through her and then to our jewelers and then from there they get back to her and Barbara ships. So she's kind of the hub which everything goes in and out of. And then we have Susan who does our purchasing. And now we'll come through to the workshop. Here's Colette who does some of our production. Actually Colette does a bunch of different things for us. She makes jewelry, she does graphic design, she works in the gallery and answers phones. She's been with us a long time and she does just about everything that happens here in the company on the production level, customer service level. Sometimes a lot of people end up talking to Colette. We're a very dog friendly place. This is Josie. This is Michelle's dog, American Boxer. Come on in through here. And Here's Michelle who does a lot of our jewelry. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> what are you working on? I'm cleaning up some rings. Um, this is after it's been oxidized and then I clean up the edges a little bit and then the next step is to polish. So let me get a close-up of it. Here are some other things. We had this woman come and or this wanted to make a different design out of all these different stones and so we're designing a number of custom pieces using these stones that are going to go to her family as some kind of memento. So there's a huge number of different things that we do. One thing that's interesting here is we start with sheets of, of silver and gold like this. This is number 20. It's a piece of silver and it means 20 gauge so it has a certain thickness to it. So typically a lot of jewelers are working off CAD cam or some other technique that's more mechanical. We actually work with these old style techniques indigenous to the American Southwest. I'm coming in through here and you can see some of the tools we use here. We bend, we shape metal with tools like this. It's a real old style workshop in many ways. Over here we have tools for cutting and we have our polishing room here where all the jewelry is polished on wheels, machinery. And come on through here. These are shears over here for cutting silver, gold sheets, and we have various tools here for sizing rings, for creating 
presses, all, all these old style techniques that actually work with bending and forming metal. Now we're going to come in back through the main room again and I'll show you how in the studio. So this is a traditional southwest cottonwood stump. These it comes were, from the Indian school, right? It comes from the Santa Fe Indian school? Yeah. And these stumps were used and passed down generation to generation among jewelers in, in the southwest. Okay. You can see that hammer is attached to the bottom. This is a anvil that's over 100 years old. It was all hand forged. It's from Wisconsin. It's from Wisconsin. I bought it from a blacksmith there. And this is Helen's workstation. She does a lot of designing here. Is something, is there something new? I haven't even seen it. It's something that never just got put out there. It hasn't got put out there yet. <laughs> and, uh, this is my soldering station. Where she solders. And what's in that tray over there? Oh, this is... These are items. We made these masters and sent them off to the casters to get cast. And so now we're... I'm putting them together in potential designs. And they'll be... In here we'll put gold... We'll sort of gold elements and we'll put stones and we'll hook them together and we'll be making a bracelet out of these. But it takes, it's a long process. First of all, we make the masters, we take, send the masters off to get cast, then we bring them back, we have to build them, and you know, it's just. It takes a while. Takes a while. That's yeah. right. And let's come on through here. This is our shop dog. Come on. Hey. There. Say hi. And we also have a patio where people sometimes sometimes have their lunch outside here. We have a nice garden area. And we also have a pretty well equipped kitchen where people do their own cooking for lunch. And that kind of that concludes our studio tour. That gives you a sense of like who we are, what we do, and thanks for watching.